People keep asking me, oh, when's Cooking with Mitch episode two coming out? <laughs> People keep asking me when I'm gonna make a second cooking video, and I didn't actually plan on it because the first one was spontaneous. But because enough people have harassed me about making a second one, here we go! I'm home from work early in the afternoon, so I'm hungry and I'm gonna make pork chops. I'm gonna make porky choppies. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six pork chops. So I've already put oil in the pan. Just sprayed it in there with this little spray can. Canola oil. Spray slash French. And apparently you're supposed to put it on medium heat, so medium, which is four. It's half, halfway between high and low, because I guess it goes up to seven. Here are the pork chops, and I'm gonna try to get these open one-handed. Whoa, that's a, not bad. Not bad, for the most part. Highly skilled at taking plastic off of pork chops with one hand. There we go. Now the recipe, I guess, calls for putting thyme on it. You know, the, the, the spice, not the, the space time, not the physics, not the... Not the thing that has seconds and minutes and hours. I don't want to put on thyme, salt, or pepper on these because I'm hungry now. That sounds messy. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put on... <laughs> it's, it's Cool Runnings. It's, isn't that copyrighted? Cool Runnings meat seasoning. Ideal for meats and vegetables. Wow. A taste of the islands. Quality number one. What does that even mean? I can't focus on it. And we're just gonna sprinkle that on there. This is all one-handed. Woohoo! <laughs> People are probably looking at this. Oh goodness. What is he doing? Oh, oh my god. That is way too much. I put on a little bit too much on, on there. So I'm just gonna rub it around. Yeah. Rub that around. Mmm. I'm gonna take this one and rub it on the other ones. Oh god! What are you doing? Oh Rubbing it around. Now, if I remember what happened from last time, is that this is gonna fucking. It's just gonna burn. Anyway, so now we're gonna flip them over. Remember, this is step 18. Have you been following along the steps? Because I don't think you have been. And then you end, and then you end, and then you end, and then you season the second side. I'll be more cautious this time. Maybe not. Maybe not. There we go. I'm just gonna rub it in with my clean fingers. The pan feels warm, which is a four letter word. Um, I got new tongs. These ones have rubber tips, so I don't scratch the crap out of my pan like I have been with my metal ones. And so we're gonna use these bad boys to flip the pork chops, the porky choppies. I'm gonna put them on the pan now. Let's, let's see how that goes. Uh, okay. I don't think I was recording, but I put them all on the pan. <laughs> They're nice and evenly spread, as you can see. I might have to use the tongs. Okay, and they just fell in the sink. There we go, make it a nice little star. And we'll put the timer on for four minutes. And we're gonna need a lid. Now we just wait four minutes. I swear to God, if you guys complain, this one isn't as good as the first one. I mean, I'll probably just agree with you. But they're looking a bit cookied. They're looking... Oh, three... Uh, it just went off. 
Don't you hate it when you miss it and it just beeps at you? You're like, I know. I get it. You're beeping. And so now I'm going to flip them over with these with these crab mitts. So some of these are like golden brown, others are less so. Now we wait four more minutes. I have to use my microwave because this goddamn oven doesn't have a timer on it, which is uh, it's pretty pretty shite. That's the peeper. Look at these golden peepers. Pork chops. The pork chops are alive with the sound of music. Some are cooked way more than others. This is a this is a problem. I'm just gonna rotate them around a little bit. So I'm running into problems. One being that the stove itself isn't level. Two being that the burner itself isn't level with the stove top which itself is a level. And three, I don't know if there's a third one, I don't know why they said there was, they said there was three problems? Why am I listing off as there's three? Anyway, those are the, those are the issues. And so, everything just kind of tilts to the side, which is annoying, which is not a four letter word. You can always rock in your rocking chair while you're waiting for your uh, porky choppies to cookie uppy. And this is what I've been putting the, cam the camera on to hold the camera when I'm not holding it. His hand just naturally fell off. I didn't do that. So let's take a look. Stand back for the steam. All right, they're looking pretty good. I think we're ready to eat them. And by we, I mean me, because you guys aren't eating shit. They're starting to burn. All right, it looks like they're done. And so what you want to do is you want to get a plate and uh, there, look at that. That's beautiful. I can't wait to gnaw on those porky chubbies. And so now I will eat the pork chops with some G2, which is Gatorade with slightly less sugar. I might need utensils to eat the pork chops, but I guess, I, could, I could probably just use my hand, right? Well, that was episode two. Um, I hope you're not too disappointed in me. Maybe episode three I'll actually try something that's uh, difficult and not a piece of shit recipe. Well, peace!